and you could eat another bite pops up and ruins the screenshot. <laughs> oh my god, werewolf, I forgot about them. Welcome back, everybody, to Valheim. I am the Bearded OG, and in this episode, we are going to go into the mountains. Uh, so I, uh, after I left in the last episode, I hiked up along here and found this mountain range. Just went up uh, in the southern portion just to see if I could find a silver vein, uh, which I did not. Killed a couple wolves, and also I was attacked by a couple of wyverns, and we took them out. And then it was getting dark, so I figured, okay, you know, I, I didn't want to really do any more uh, until we started the next episode. Uh, and I set up a, another outpost uh, in that area. So I think we're ready to, to head up there. Uh, let's refresh all of our food here. Uh, we'll put our wishbone uh, in place of our belt so we can look for silver. And I've got extra stuff to make another portal once we do find a silver location. I think we're fully repaired on everything, so yeah, let's do this. Let's head on through the portal. I'm not actually sure what time of day it is. It looks like it's getting on into the afternoon, so... Um, um, incidentally, this was... This was actually the place that I set up a little base a few episodes ago when we were trying to get into the swamp. Um, so it's kind of funny that we came back to this almost exact same location. Uh, but then I decided not to do that swamp because, you know, there weren't any crypts in it. So, yeah, real funny. Okay, let's, um... Oh, nuts. Okay. I need feathers. <laughs> seem to have a shortage on feathers all the time. I'm just trying to see if that bird lands again. Get out of here. All right. I don't even want his giblets. Okay. So let's head on up the mountain here, and we will start working our way to the north. Uh, since I kind of pretty much, like I said, covered the southern part of the mountain. And uh, hopefully we will find ourselves a silver vein so we can get going in with that. All right, so I hear some wolves up ahead, and we're going to need to pop some of those, too, so let's just do that right now. Oh, there's the wolf right there. He's eating deer, fighting a skelly, and ripping them all a new one. So the skelly softened him up for us a little bit. Oh, good. We got a wolf trophy, too. Uh, I think that's the first time we've uh, gotten one of those. Okay, so, yeah, uh, like I said, I, I covered this area, and my uh, wishbone did not ping a single time, so we're just going to start heading north. All right, I'm back. I got interrupted by a phone call. Uh, and we got a blizzard too, so that's just wonderful. Can't see shit. But uh, let's press on uh, for, you know, as far as we can before it gets too dark. I'd really like to find a silver vein. Okay, here comes a, another wolf. Guess we stunned him. I didn't realize he was thunder. I would have just kept going after him there. Um, I, uh, oh no, okay. I have the bone mass uh, power now, but I, I can't activate it because it's on cooldown. Because I accidentally, oh look, he killed this deer. Uh, I accidentally hit the button like I am prone to do. <laughs> but uh, we'll be using that. Um, or, or at least switching it back and forth between Ikther and that. I, I don't care much for the Elder Power. It helps you get more wood, but I mean, unless you're having a, a very specific scheduled, you know, wood cutting session, it's I don't find that very useful, to be honest with you. 
I'm also, you know, looking for more obsidian too, but I'm not seeing it up here. Yeah, that's just going to go back down into the black forest there. Hmm. So that goes down into black forest too. So it looks like maybe this mountain range is kind of petering out on us as well. That sucks. Not even one single fucking silver vein, man. What the hell? Unless it widens out again further north, which I guess it could. All right, well, let's just keep going north and see what happens. And if it doesn't amount to anything, we'll have to go somewhere else. Oh, shit. Two wolves. All right, we got him. It does look like maybe the mountains are widening up again. Two more wolves down there. They not get up the. Oh man, I'm on uneven terrain here. They're gonna kill me. <clears throat> I need stamina. That was close. Oh, stressful. <laughs> All right. Where are we at? Tell you what we'll do. Let's work our way kind of around this way and see if we can determine, you know, the boundaries of the mountain. Well, I already see meadow right down there, so... So we need to kind of go more this direction. It does get higher though, so that's good in terms of a better chance for resources. Could also mean wyverns, but we need to kill them too. So it's like the worst weather, man. <laughs> There's a wyvern. Whoops. Or, sorry, Drake, not Wyvern. Drake, Wyvern, they're all the same thing. I know, some of you are probably going, no, they're not! They're just smaller versions of dragons. That's the way I think of them. Alright, we got some more freeze glands, which we need for crafting stuff. Um, Did I just hear a golem? I did. He is right there. Okay, this guy's kind of a pain in the ass. Um, don't really want to fight him on a uneven ground. I wonder if we can. How far away we can pull him from his spot, or even maybe lose him. Stamina. Alright, so yeah, he went way down there. I'd like to get some of this obsidian, too. Thing is, is he pursuing us, though? He, he might not be able to get up here. He kind of looks like he can't, so let's grab some of this while we can. Oh, 
All right, I don't know where that dude went. I think I may hear another Drake though. I hear him walking around, I just don't see him. Oh, silver. I think our golem buddy's right on the other side of this rock wall, though. To be really careful not to run out of stamina on this hillside. Okay, there's a... There's a drake there, and... There. I can't really move though. So I'm just gonna have to take the hits. Okay, so his stuff landed on that stone down there. Um, can I do a Hail Mary from here? Oh, there's two drakes. Well, we got his attention. We lost our rested bonus. All right, that's sliding all the way the hell down there. All right, let's go back down and grab this. Got a Drake trophy. What I'm going to do is I'm going to mark this as a silver location. Um, but because we no longer have rested bonus... Um... Probably should just go home and come back in the morning. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. So let's slide down and get this other freeze gland. But at least we know there's silver around. Okay. All right, yeah, so I'm going to work my way back home. And I'll meet you guys back in this area in the morning. Got a little bit of a hike to do, so better get moving. All right, guys, uh, we are back here. And uh, what I did uh, was I brought my long ship over uh, to this location here. And let's actually put a thingy here. Geez, outpost. Okay. Um, and then the silver's just right up here on the mountain. And I took down my uh, my other fort that was down this way. So, it's probably, I don't know, around noonish, Maybe a little past noon, but we should have enough time, I think, to get up there and, and get started mining the silver. Uh, this is a Draugr... I'm pretty sure it's a Draugr village anyways, that we sailed past several episodes ago. I haven't done anything with it. Um, we should maybe go over there and uh, see if we can find some uh, beehives, maybe? In fact, is that beehive there? Or is it a Draugr? Yeah, it is a beehive. Nice. Well, look at that. And then we'll come along and do this. All right, that, that makes it easy enough. Cool, all right, so we got another beehive. All right, so I think um, over here on the, a little fur, further to the northwest, uh, there was a more, a little bit more of a gradual path up 
to where we were before. So let's go that way. I made myself some more frost resist potions and some more uh, medium health thingies. Let's take that. Let's put this on. And let's also put this on. There's wolves over that way. Wyvern? Or, um, Drake, I mean. Still calling them wyverns. Three of them. Nice. down. He's down. I guess that one wasn't quite down yet. Got it. the giblets from that one go? Oh, there they are. Let's see if we can find it from the other two. They're going to be further down the hill. Uh, there's one. Did we kill three or four? Hmm. Killed at least three. Oh shit. I'm on uh, uneven terrain here. Hmm. Uh, the frost essence stuff, or whatever the hell that blue stuff is, might have fallen all the way down into the forest. I'd go after it if I could see it, but I can't, so I think we're going to just not worry about it. We'll have plenty plenty more drakes to kill. Before it's all said and done, that's for sure. Alright, let's go this way. We're probably going to run into that um, golem again. See, we were, yeah, we were kind of heading up this way when the thing started pinging. Jeez, how many drakes are there? Grab this obsidian. And I think there was some. Yeah, there's some over here too. Oh, here's one of uh, Motor's eggs. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to. Uh, where's our belt at? We have to put our belt on. So, I believe what we have to do is find three of these uh, in order to summon motor. I know the guys already have uh, several eggs too, but I think what I'm going to have to do now that I've got this egg 
and I'm loading up on obsidian because so I'm going to have to 429, yeah. I'm going to have to go back down and drop all this stuff off. So let's get one more little thingy of obsidian here. We don't need that. Uh, I want to keep everything else. 443. So I'll just meet you guys back up here. Alright, so we are uh, fairly close to where the pinging started the last time we were up here. Okay, there it is right there. Um, so let's go this way. Oh, there's a shack up here. We could actually use that to our advantage. Frost arrows. Nice. Okay, so the silver is basically right here at this cabin. Come on. Drake's all over the place. What if I should just be using my iron arrows on these guys? There's another egg over there. Uh, and a wolf, too. Okay, so the silver is basically right here. Um, well, we still haven't cleared all the enemies out. Let's switch to iron arrows. Um, we don't need this on any longer either, so let's put our weight belt back on. Oh, we one-shot it with an iron arrow. Okay. Let's see if we can hit that wolf. I can just barely see him. Got him. There's another wolf. Got him too. Um, oh, here we go. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Um, we're going to actually enclose this cabin and make a little outpost up here. And I'm going to actually set down a portal up here just so we ourselves can go back home and recharge and all that. And we can take the obsidian with us. Uh, all right, so let's put some of this heavier stuff in here. And we're going to need to cut some wood. There's another drake over there. I'm not too concerned about those guys. I just don't want the um to get the golems' attention at the moment. Oh shit! All right, 
Where'd he go? I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Okay, come back over here so you're on a nice flat area when I kill you. Beautiful. Okay. So, yeah, we're going to kind of be doing this in the dark, but, oh well. There's the, there's a third egg down there. All right. Wow. I think, is it? Yeah, definitely. Well, we have all the eggs we need to summon motor then. Just got to find where motor is. But, again, we're going to be doing that multiplayer anyway, so... The other guys already know where he's at. Okay, good. At least the snow stopped. How much weight do I have? 239. Ooh, that's a cool picture. A cool view there. And you could eat another bite pops up and ruins the screenshot. <laughs> oh my god. Werewolf. I forgot about them. Shit. Did he... Did he see us? Oh, shit! Yeah. Oh, boy. This could be dangerous. He's coming this way, though. Alright, here. Let's, uh... Let's make sure we're at full health. Is he a normal werewolf, or is he a starred? Because if he's a starred... That isn't good for us. Oh, where's he going? He must have just de aggroed us. Okay. Then let's... Let's get a crafting station down real quick. And what do we got going on here? All right, for now, I'm just going to use these because. I don't have core wood on me. Oh, we're out of wood. Okay. Um, let's do this then. You know what? Screw that guy. We'll get him later. I want to go home and rest up and repair. Am I the only one on the server? Damn it, I'm not. Okay, I can't sleep. That's the downside to multiplayer. Okay. Um, I'm going to rest up. I'm going to also... Uh, make a little more food and drop off this stuff and I'll meet you guys back up at our little cabin there in the morning. All right. We're back and it's mostly morning. I made myself um, some obsidian arrows, which are even better than iron arrows. Let's take this guy out. Okay. Um, I don't think it's officially morning. It's just about morning. So, got to be careful with that werewolf.
Yeah, I completely forgot that werewolves come out at night in the mountains. <laughs> Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and I'm going to make a fire. I need some stone. We're going to actually get a lot of stone from mining. this roof piece. That should work for there. It's just very makeshift. Nothing fancy. gonna smoke us out, isn't it? Alright, what if we do the same thing, but go the other direction with it. Okay, we'll try that. Sure, we can put that door there, why not? I know this is cheese, but again, it's just a makeshift shelter for us. Okay. I think this should be good. Um, we have stuff in there, right? Okay. Let's make another chest. Can I scooch it all the way back there? Can I scooch it that far? It's going to be a little tight in here. Um, break that. Pick that up. Put the two eggs in there. Um, still don't have enough. That's all right. Okay. I think we're ready to do some mining. If the, if the monsters will leave us alone. So the silver vein's right about here. Let's get the obsidian too. Probably doing this mining is going to attract their attention. So let's just go right down here. back on. Slower that way. Is that silver? No, that's just stone. Comes. 
Seems pretty hot right about here. Maybe it's just deeper down. There it is. Okay. Nice. All right, so what I like to do with the silver veins is I like to expose... We don't need that on anymore. I like to expose them first before I mine them. Um, just so I can kind of see where everything is. Alright, so that's the vein. And we'll put our first stone stack down there. Alright guys, well, um, basically what I'm going to do at this point is just mine this entire vein out and... When I'm finished doing that, I'll bring you back and I'll show you how much we got. And then we'll have to haul it down to the to the long ship. Oh, I keep forgetting. We have the the vein mine mod. <laughs> That's so cheaty. <laughs> and it's so convenient too. Okay, yeah. Vein mine. Mm-hmm. Gotta love it. Okay, so I got all of the silver. And we basically have 90 silver and two eggs that need to be hauled down to the ship. But before we do that, before I do that, let's see if we can find another vein relatively close by. Uh, our, little, our little shed here. Oh. Seriously? No, I think it's still picking up this one. No? I don't think so. I think there's another vein real close by. Yeah, it's right about here somewhere. Oh, that's perfect. Right next to our base. All right, let's dig down. Yep, there it is. All right, fantastic. Um, What happens if you... What happens if you... Try and break it without exposing it first. Okay, so let's deal with this wolf. Got him. Um, all right, so what happens if we try and vein mine this like this? Nothing. Oh. Oh, it pops it all up to the surface? Oh, man, that is total hacks. <laughs> I'll take it, though. Oh, my God. That's funny. Did, is that what happened, though? Well, uh, what I'll do is I'll gather it all up. I'll gather it all up, and if I don't have ninety pieces, then that means some of it's maybe still stuck in the ground. I don't know. All right, I'll bring you back uh, once I do that. I'm gonna go grab this this uh, wolf stuff. All right, so we're only five ore short, and I don't find it hard to believe that there's five silver ore stuck under the ground when everything else came out um so i'm gonna say we got it all maybe maybe not all veins have a total of 90 ore in them i don't know 
Either that or it is stuck stuck in the ground. I don't know. I, I just... I don't know. Okay, well, anyway. Let's try this one more time. Let's see if we can find another vein close by. There's some uh, some kind of structure up on top of the of oh, that thingy. Yep, we do have something no nearby. Fortress. Okay, so I think what we're after is this direction. I remember when I used to play too, um, sometimes you could find a silver vein that was partially exposed, like especially if it was on a steep hillside or something. Is there another one over this way? Golem down there. Oh. It's right about here. I'm a little concerned about that golem down there. refresh all of that so we're at maximum health and all that. Uh, let's put this back on too. Hmm. Kind of find it hard to believe that it would be this far down. this back on. Okay, let's try it right here. Got him. I think there's something over this way too. Let's do this. Oh, that's probably the first one we detected because it's still marked. I just came around a different way. Okay, let's leave this one here. And let's go back and see if we can figure out where this one is. Yep, there it is right there. Okay, let's do this. Yeah, it looks like it all just pops right out of the ground. Okay, cool. 
Um, all right, let me get all this haul uh, hauled back over. All right, so we got even less out of that last vein. I wonder if there's a diminish in returns thing going on here or something. I don't know. Uh, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to the base with a load of stuff I can take to the portal, which is all of this except for the two eggs. Refresh my rested bonus, and then I'm going to go hit that other uh, vein that I have marked. And then start hauling all of it down to the longship and bring it back to the base and start smelting it. Uh, okay. Let's put those two together so I can see how much I got. Uh, we currently have 23 wolf pelt. Wolf pelts. Four wolf heads. Three drake heads. And we have... 20 freeze glands and five wolf teeth. So that's uh, the loot that we've gotten so far. Uh, so anyway, I will bring you guys back um, when we get, when I get back here and I start smelting the silver and I pick up the first piece so you can see what recipes that, that will unlock. So I'll see you, well, for you in a second or two. For me, probably a couple hours. It's going to take a while to do this. All right, guys, I'm back. Uh, it took me quite a while <laughs> to haul all this stuff back over here, but uh, we got it done. And um, so we're going to do our first load into our uh, smelters here. Um, okay. That's not the best positioning. I guess I'll just have to jump to do it. And uh, when the first piece of silver pops out, or silver ingot, I guess, um, it should unlock a bunch of stuff for us. There we go. All right. We've got the wolf hide armor, silver arrows, the Draugr fang, nice. Wolf fur cape, drake helmet, silver kniffy, silver shield, fang spear, and silver sword. We're going to make that silver sword for sure and start to... Uh, Leveling that up. Um, if we also access this, does it open, uh, give us more stuff? Sometimes I've noticed when you uh, open a craft bench, then it even unlocks more stuff, it seems. What about here? Uh, crafting doesn't look like we can make a new crafting station to upgrade to anything um you're like level four right yeah okay so that's maybe that's a, all the higher we can take that if we put the silver in here there we go the butcher's table and a treasure chest I'll bet the butcher's table upgrades our our food Cauldron improvement. Yep. Um, let's do it now. I'm just going to put it right there. All right. What does that open up for us in here? Ice cream, level three cauldron, and wolf jerky. Uh, 33 health, 33 stamina, 3 HP per tick. Okay. So that's good, just kind of middle of the road food, I guess. Ice cream. Oh, from freeze glands. <laughs> and great dwarf eyes. Oh, that's hilarious. Uh, so this gives 65 stamina, 21 health, compared to 55 and 18. Uh, what about compared to muck shake? 50, yeah. Okay, so that's a nice little food upgrade for us right there. Okay, so this will become our new stamina food. And 
I think... I mean, this is nice and all, but... That's 55 stamina, 33. I still think we're going to stick with black soup and sausages for health, though. But we will replace muck shake... Uh, or, no, we'll replace turnips. Turnips to his 18 health. 21 health, 65. Okay, so that's a duration of 25, 25. This still gives 2 HP per tick. This, uh, this one only gives 1. So, I don't know. I'll have to think about that. There's, you know, pros and cons to both of them, of course. All right. Let's get you reloaded, and we'll go get another load of silver. Uh, but anyways, guys, we're going to go ahead and wrap up the episode here, and I'm just going to spend the next million years um, smelting all this silver up, and then we will make the, the new stuff. So... We're going to make um, the Draugr Fang, the Drake Helmet, the Silver Shield, the Silver Sword, and the Wolf Hide stuff. And once we have this Wolf Hide stuff, um, we won't need to uh, take Frost Potions in the mountains anymore. Because it, it'll give us uh, Resistant versus Frost. Uh, and also the Cape, too, which I think is... We'll make that over here. Yeah, the wolf fur cape, uh, which, too, gives us uh, resistance versus frost. So I'm going to work on, you know, making all of that stuff and getting it upgraded. If I don't have enough silver to make it all and fully upgrade it all, um, you know, then we'll go back and, uh, or I will go back, rather, to the mountains and, and keep mining silver until I do have enough and once, once we're fully kitted out in silver, um, then I think I'm going to start doing some multiplayer stuff with the other guys um, where we'll take on motor and then kind of go from there. Uh, also, I am planning on uh, building a loft um, on both sides of the base here and moving our bedroom upstairs uh, because one thing I can do now, and I've actually been able to do this for a while, is I can make the... Uh, stone throne and the dragon bed and um, you know that'll that'll get our uh, our rested bonus better but we just don't really have room well I don't know how big is that bed let's just make it real quick even if it's even if we don't have enough room uh, we can still just use it for now. Why am I... So, oh, because I forgot to put the... forgot to put the silver in. Um, but... I know this is really jank, but that's the whole reason <laughs> why I need to, uh... you know, make the loft. And that didn't... Oh, yeah, they gave us comfort 12. Okay, so that did bump us up a level, because we were at 11 before. So, yeah, we'll make a loft, um, you know, which will be become our bedroom. And, um, is there anything else? All right, we can make a wolf rug, too. That I'm going to hold off on, though, until I at least get the full armor set. We s we probably have enough, but... Uh, uh, okay, right, we needed to make the stone throne as well, which, call again, requires wolf pelt. So, yeah, I'll get... Uh, I want to get my armor and my cape and all that stuff made first. And then, you know, uh, we're, we're going to almost certainly need to go hunt more wolf anyways. More wolves. Uh, for upgrades and other things. And, you know, we'll, of course, do that in another episode. So, with that being said, thanks, everybody, for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share the video. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>